but you've heard the influence of Mumatone on reggaeton in there or all mm. those producers. And again, I'm sure in the beginning, it was hard for them to wrap their heads around it of like what this music was and <laughs> totally dismiss it. What it even it. means, yeah. Exactly, it because it's, they're clearly waving the reggaeton flag, been doing it for God knows how many years. And they hear something called Mumatone. Like, it's one thing to be in the EDM community and hear that. And then you have a point of reference with the Chucky song and stuff like that. If you know, you know, like Dutch House, there's mm -hmm. a point of reference. But imagine being in reggaeton and, and hearing that word. No point of reference. You have, you're like, get the fuck out of here with this bullshit. <laughs> I don't want to hear the, 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 the car alarms. Like, I don't want to hear none of that. I, I get it. I totally mm -hmm. get it. But fast forward 10 years later, it's they clearly inspired Clearly inspired them. And, and that's not to take anything away from them because they're making no, amazing no, no. shit yeah, as well. of course not. But it's like, we should all be working hand in hand together Like well, at this point. At this point, I, I love to see it in a way. I love the fact that I can sit here and say that I felt that I was part of a movement collectively that inspired a sound that became as popular as it did. But it makes me sad that... it there's no representation for us in that at all. For sure. 